Hello and a very warm welcome. My name is Odo Sendaidukai and in this video I show you how you can easily bring a lot of expression into your play or into your performance even without an MPE controller. It would be great if you would leave me a like and a subscription, but let's get started. This is really just a reminder because basically you probably know it all. MPE is absolutely great and MPE controller like the Linsrent by Roger Lin or the Erai Touch by Me, or even instruments like the Osmos by Expressive E with the excellent Hagen Audio Egan Matrix sound engine are just awesome. With a touch of a finger, expression is swiped into the sound. But this all has its price from 800 to 2000 euros currently in 2023 and certainly much more money can be spent. Here only the sky is the sky, spoken like Icke und Er. But, and you know me well enough, there that I usually have a but about something like this. So, but not having an MPE controller is not an excuse for not being able to put expression into your music while playing to bring expression into your performance because you already have everything or you can get very close to the possibilities of an MPE controller for relatively cheap money. So if you feel like it and you are mainly about the music, let's start with simple examples to understand or to remember how this works again. And it's even easier than you might think right now. Let's start with something nice. How do you get sounds beautiful right off the start? That's right, just add a little reverb or delay. It makes a sawtooth sound more interesting, like glitter and fairy dust. But that's exactly what we are not going to use right now, because what the reverb and delay effects do wonderfully is to move the sound. Now we want to literally take that into our own hands while performing. But what comes next in the series of the most popular simple effects? right the filter and most of the time it's a low pass filter so now that would always be like the first point of call for you and me but of course there are more this can be done with many different synthesizers hardware as well as software i'll do this here using the search xt synthesizer as an example and then i'll move on to some of the bitwig synthesizers and their presets which are great but many of them don't or rather rarely make use of this way of playing or moving the sound with more expression. Often in these presets, Bitwix excellent modulators have the focus, but for this, the manual influence has been somewhat marginalized, which means for us now so far, we can massively upgrade these presets with very simple ways. A small side note, my UHE plugins Hive 2 and Zebra 2 give me, with the help of the XY pads, very often many possibilities of additional expressions by effects manually to use and dose. But now um, to the core of what I'm talking about all the time. Many thanks to all who gave the video a thumbs up. I'm talking about the things you probably already have. A mod wheel, mostly um, controlled by MIDI CC1. An expression pedal, controlled by MIDI CC11. Such an expression pedal costs around 15 to 20 euros. Poly aftertouch, channel aftertouch, something your controller or your keyboard is capable of. Velocity itself, how hard or soft you hit a key. And of course, release velocity, so how fast you release a key. And even if you don't have all the options or even more like a second mod wheel or an XY pad or you use the knobs on your controller or whatever, you can easily take your performance or sound to the next level. What are the typical effects? As said, filter. Maybe overdrive a filter with drive here and there. Maybe resonance, volume anyway. Envelopes, attack, decay, sustain, release. Detune, 
Unison Detune, Heartsync, Noise, or whatever, whatever else spontaneously catches your eye and might fit. So actually everything. I will now run through a few examples below where I simply select a preset and then use Modwheel Expression Pedal, Release Velocity and Aftertouch. For the Modwheel I'm using MIDI CC modulator that responds to MIDI CC1. And for my Expression Pedal I'm also using a MIDI CC modulator to CC11. I'll start with the Search XT synthesizer and presets first and then move on to Bitwig synthesizer and presets. While I'm doing this, I won't talk, but will blend in what I'm doing, just so you can better focus on the sound and how it moves and changes. So have fun.
If you like to keep seeing videos like this, give me a like and, a, and subscribe to the channel. My name is Odo Sendaidukai. Thanks for watching and paying attention. And if you have any other questions or feedback, or you've noticed anything unusual, let me know in the comments. I hope to see you soon again in the next video. Stay healthy, save the future. Take care. See you then. Ciao, ciao.